Hi, I'm Rachel from The Wrong Crowd and this is Robin. And today we're going to be showing you how to make puppets out of bits and pieces in your recycling bin. Here's one that we've made earlier. And these are our buckle, buckle buddies. Buddy buddies. Buddy buddies. Um, we will be using a lot of sharp tools, hot glue guns, drills, scissors. So you should always be making your bottle buddy with an adult. First of all, you'll need some bottles and milk cartons. Cardboard tubes, some plastic tops, bottle tops, some cotton reels, and some lollipop sticks. Some rope or some string, um, a large lid of some kind, some flexible pipe, an ice lolly stick holder, and some buttons or washers, and some heavy duty tape. And the kind of tools that you'll need for this are a drill, a glue gun, some scissors, a pair of pliers, a scalpel, some wire and a hacksaw. So we're going to start showing you how to make the head out of this milk carton and it naturally makes a face doesn't it? Yeah. Yeah and we're going to make the eyes out of the bottle tops so that's the first thing that we're going to yes. do. So first off which, which bottle tops are we going to use? That one, that one and that one okay Brilliant. We're going to glue them down. So my trusty assistant on the glue gun. So we glue all around the edge. Stick that down to make the first eye. Brilliant. And the next one, you stick it down. In there. Brilliant. So that's for the start of our making our heads. And do you think that we need to put something in the yes. middle of that eye to make it glint? So we're going to use a washer to put in the middle of that green eye. Yeah? yeah? Put some glue into that eye. Yeah, that's it. Great. That's enough. And then we drop the washer in there. So he has a little glinting eye. Next thing, we need to make a slit in the back yes. to um, make the flexible pipe go into the back of his head. Yeah. So, I'll do this because it's yeah. scalpel time. You make a cut into the back of his head and then another cut going across there. Now we've cut in the back of here, we need to stick this in, don't we? Yeah. So, if you put some glue around the edge of that, all the way around, and then we stick that into the back. And let it set. We should put some more glue around there. Okay. Yeah. Around the edges. And in the front there. Great. Lovely job. So we let that sit and dry for a moment. Our little head. So the next thing we're going to show you how to make is the wheel, is the base and how our puppet moves around, isn't it? Um, so what we'll need is um, the large round lid top. We need the wire. We'll need the lollipop sticks. Yep. We'll need uh, a top, one of the tops of the, of the water bottles. And we need our drill. And we also need some wood for safety. We do. We need our piece of wood underneath um, so you don't drill into your best table and get the adults to help you with this. So, we get our lollipop sticks and we drill through here. So it's down the one end of the lollipop stick, okay? Not right at the end, but just, just up from the end. And then we can get rid of that. Right, glue gun now on our red lid. Ready? around the edges. So this is for, for going on the inside of this wheel. Excellent. Great. Okay. So we put that in the middle of that hole so it balances it up to make a proper, proper wheel. Yeah? Yeah. Then we need to get our drill again and drill a hole through the middle of the red lid. Then we 
get our two lollipop sticks and put them either side of this wheel. This creates a little axis point, so you'll be able to run around. Get your wire and put your wire through. Bend these bits of wire up the sides and then we glue gun that to the lollipop sticks. Do the other side? Either side of there. And then that. So that holds our wheels securely and can move around. Look at that. Woo! Yeah! Okay, so we put that aside and let that dry for a bit. And next thing we're going to look at is making the arms, which is going to be this is where our cardboard tubes come into play. Um, we're going to cut in the middle of them to make the elbow joint. Yeah? So this is when we need our hacksaw. Yeah? And we're going to cut around about in the middle. But don't cut all the way through, which means you can get an elbow joint there. Okay? And you do this on the other one. And now, after a while, that elbow joint will snap, won't it? So we need to put some yes. tape around it. So let's get our bit of gaffer tape. And can you put that around there for me? Yes. Yeah? No, I'll do the other one. So we've taped all the way around, but we're going to cut back into this now. I'm going to cut that. And I'm going to cut that down to there. So those are our elbows. Yes. Yep. Next thing is then drill a hole through the top of this joint bit there. Yeah? So you're able to do this. Next thing, use your wood. So we're going to drill through, making sure the elbow is going out towards the back. And then do it. Drill through. Okay. And then we do the other one. So now we've done our elbows, yeah. um, we're going to look at putting in um, our holding, that little... Um, little holding thing so you, so, you can make sure, so you can make the arms move. So you can animate it, yeah. So we're going to get a lolly stick and cut it in half, get your scalpel and you cut into the back and then you make a little hole for these lolly sticks to go on in. Yes. Yeah. And then slot them in, into the back here and this is how you hold your arm you're going to animate it then yeah yeah okay great oh we need to put a bit of glue in there so it stays oh, yeah. yep okay and give me a bit of glue on that one lovely another bit on the other side and then stick it into the slot now we've got that Ready to go, and we're going to put our hands on. Yeah. And what are we going to make them out of? These. Yeah. What are they? They are bottle lids. Yes. So we put some glue in the base of it and then stick that, that into yeah. there. Okay. And that becomes our little bottle buddy's hand. Yeah. We're in. Glue it in. Now you leave them to dry. Yes, exactly. So then they can stay there and dry. So now we're going to look at doing the body. Yes. Now you make your body out of um, any water bottle. Yeah. It could be even bigger than this one if you wanted to, but this is what we've got. Yeah. And we're going to make some holes for the arms to, to go into. Like that. Yeah? So get our drill again, and we're going to drill through the top, which is because this is going to be its shoulders, yeah? And we're going to do a little hole here. There we go, through there, and directly opposite, on the other side, do that again. Okay. Then, we get our string, or our cord, and we're going to 
thread it through here, get it the other side. This is a bit tricky, but oh my word, we've done it first time. Whoa, ho, ho. so this goes through the bottle here. Now we need to get our arms. Now you do that, you do the one side, and do the other, making sure that the, the, little sticks. the little sticks are facing the same way, okay? And then you thread it through. Thread it through. So we, then we've got our arms there. So yeah. you do an, a double knot that side. Please. Okay. And this is to hold them in place. So now you've done that knot on the one side, you pull it through pull and you do another one. And that's your arms. Woo! The arms are done. Arms are done. Brilliant. Okay. And now we work on the bottom. Yep. We're going to work on detaching the wheel onto the base. So what we need to do now is then drill holes in the bottom so we'll be able to put our lollipop sticks in. Yeah. So we get our drill. Yeah. And then you get your base and just see how far apart you need to do the other hole. Okay, so it's about two centimetres apart. So now we've got our holes at the base of our bottle, we're now going to slot these in and then glue them. Either side of the hole. Brilliant work. Okay, so we let that dry for a second. And there it is. So now we've attached our wheel and it's moving. Um, we need to go back to our head. And first of all, our head, what it needs is a holder, doesn't it? So you can animate your head. And we're going to use one of our ice lolly sticks. Yes. So again, we get our scalpel. scalpel and we make a little slit as wide as what that is at the bottom there into the back of the head. And then we, and then we glue gun this and slot it into the back like that. And that becomes our nice holder okay yes so glue gun a bit of that yes yeah and then do a load here so then as i travel it through it'll glue as it goes yeah brilliant okay yeah. in there and that should hold Stay there. brilliant and that's our little secure holder then we go onto the neck, and this neck attaches into this bottle. But before we do that, whoop, we need to make a cut at the base of here. So cut that down. That overlaps like that. And then that makes it easier to go into the top of the bottle and into his neck. So let's put, let's give us a little bit of, and then you stick that into. Well done. Okay, so put that into the, so make sure it overlaps quite a bit and push it down. Make sure it's fully secure in it. Yes, brilliant. So there he is. Yes. So next thing we need to do, we can hold the head here and we can hold the arms, but we need something to hold the base of the body as well. So this is where your cotton reels come in. Yes. So, glue gun again. Okay. Now yes. stick that straight onto the back like that. Yeah. And then you leave that to dry. And now that's attached. That's our holder on its body. We're able to animate it now. And you can get the hand. Yay, there he is. Um, and Robin's going to show us her one that she made. She added uh, some other bits and pieces so you can add to your bottle buddy and make him into kind of any character you want. You can add it here, you can do some buttons, you can add an earring, you can do an earring, you know, it's up to you. But this is your this is your bottle buddy base. Um, and we're looking forward to seeing what you make with your bottle buddies. Bye! Bye. High five! <laughs>